Hey guys, it's Guy 389 here, and welcome back. Got another episode of Pixelmon for you guys, so let's get started. So, in the last episode, we cleared out the last two gems that are currently available. The rest will be added in later, by none other than myself, most likely. Um, I'm going to have, uh, actually, on, re on that topic, I'm going to have uh, Kyle uh, set me up so that I can set up uh, gym leaders... Uh, probably this weekend at some point, because I do have a couple days off, uh, and I am going to spend most of it working on my master's thesis, but I can probably find a little bit of time to come on here and set things up. Uh, so today I was homesick. I recorded uh, the entire FTL LP that I did. I also edited up a couple videos so that I have them in reserve for today and tomorrow. And I've also uh, uh, come all the way out here to do another episode of Pixelmon in the wild, so that we can uh, so that we can meet some new Pokemon and maybe catch something. We don't really have much else to do. Really, it's just a matter of catching uh, and training Pixelmons and stuff like that. Uh, we do have a Graveler over here. We can fight. Can fight Graveler. He will give us some XP. We can level up. Hit him with the Ice Fang. That's quad effective. He's actually doing decent damage to us, though. Don't particularly agree with that. I did set my home out here somewhere so that... I'm actually going to set it in this area afterwards. Oh wow, there are a lot of Golbats out there. I guess there must be like a cave or something. Crevasse that the uh, Zubats and stuff are spawning in. <clears throat> the interesting thing about it is in the main Pixelmon world, there are no, uh, uh, what's it called, Zubats. I came from that direction actually. But I landed way over there in a snow biome and I decided to just come all the way over here to this desert biome so we can have a look-see around. Got a Numel over here. Would be nice if we could find some bosses. Because bosses give us poker loot. And uh, we kind of need that. It's it's the best way to make money in the game is to uh, defeat bosses and get things like Master Balls and stuff that you can sell for thousands each. I mean, if if you're not lucky with finding diamonds and emeralds and stuff... Like, we could find more emeralds because we are in a, uh, our base is in a, uh, what's it called? That biome that they spawn in, the Extreme Hills biome. Uh, let's see if we can find anything. Yeah, Arcanine learns Outrage. I guess someone was confused by that. He does learn Outrage. You have to level him up as a Growlithe until, I think, level 44 or something like that. Well, I'm going to reply to that. I spelled Growlithe wrong, but, eh, whatever. Ooh! 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 Yo! Trapinch! Trapinch! No! No running away. Come back. No. I'm back. Good. Dragon Rage. Uh, we will switch over to someone that can damage you without killing you. Oh, Spark's not going to work because he's ground, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, I guess Nidorino, then. Wow, holy cow. Poison Sting? Um, this is going badly. Venoshock. Bug Bite? Uh, we'll hit him with one more Venoshock. Alright, he is low, low enough in health now that we should be able to catch him with a Pokeball. Oh, there's a Magmar out there. 
Come on, Trappage. Good. Good, good, good. Good. Alright, what level are you at? Holy cow, you, you're freaking out. Oh, he's got... He's got that whole thing going. Guess we'll try, uh, we'll try a Great Ball on him. <coughs> the Great Ball is on my shoulder. Or on my Frolligator's shoulder. I approve of this. No, it didn't work. Um, is there anything I can do that won't kill him? I guess Scorpy, maybe. And get him a Pokeball. I think we brought him down about as far as possible. If we hit him one more time, he'll die, no matter what we hit him with. Except False Swipe. I don't think he has completely one health left. Come on, don't make me use my Ultra Ball on you. Alright. Pokeball. So annoying. All right. Get in there and stay in there. I'm starting to get like superstitious and like afraid to click. <laughs> Good. We got him. Party is full. Oh, we found the ice biome again. Good. Just what I wanted. Uh, let's see. We can train Fralligator on this guy. Holy cow, level 47. I'm scared of fighting that guy. Another trap inch. He's low level. Um, I guess bosses are hard to come across then, because we haven't found a single one. Felt. Uh, let's do set home here, so we can come back, and then we'll go T spawn. Door. Uh, this guy still hasn't been on. I'm not quite sure what to do about him. Um, we stuck. I think we are. Uh, I'm going to pause the video for a second. Be right back. Hey guys, I'm back. Uh, so, I wasn't actually frozen. We just couldn't see the Pokeballs for some reason. Uh, so I did a little bit of off-camera work. Uh, fixed up some of these things. Got myself some... Uh, some more Apricorns. Made myself some extra Pokeballs. I uh, crafted up a couple extra Ultra Balls as well because... Uh, we're having trouble catching, I guess. That's 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 been the problem so far, is we just haven't been catching. We try and we fail to catch, and that is something we cannot deal with, so... Or that is unacceptable, so we are changing that. From now on, we are going to catch. Uh, I also got someone uh, new into the town here. Uh, let's see if we can find him. Don't know quite where he went... Where he ran off to, but uh, one of my subscribers log oh there he is. One of my subscribers logged in and said hi, so I added him to the town. Say hi to the camera. Nope. So um, he is. Uh, what's it called? Uh, I don't remember, what was it, Freddy, Freddy does Minecraft, does Minecraft or something like that, is his name on, uh, I can't quite remember what, it, what his in-game was, I think it was Freddy does Minecraft, I'll leave a link to his channel in the description below, 
because I'm polite like that. Uh, now we're just going to uh, quickly TP to where we were. Go back to home. And we're back in the desert. Time to catch some Pexamons. We're all healed up. Everything is fine. We've got some gold bats. Let's see if we can take on a level 44 gold bat. I think we can. Yeah, we most definitely can. Oh, yeah. You got oomped. And we get rod and flesh for that. Is this a horde of Vibrava? This is a horde of Vibrava. Get over here. I'm going to Ice Fang you. We have like a horde of Vibrava here. Just like, just mountains of them. It would be great if one of them was like a, a boss or something, but no. Ice Fang. Wow. One shot. I'll take this one out with Gyarados. He's also got Ice Fang. Ooh, Aqua Tail. Finally! Finally a water move. We've been waiting so long to get a water move on that guy. Ooh, Magnemite. Magnemite. Come on, say it. Magnemite. Say it. There we go. Magnemite. Uh, we'll see what we can do with him. Oh, he paralyzed me. Not entirely sure what we want to do with him, but we'll try Venoshock. Oh, I think he's immune to being poisoned. That's right. Let's try hitting him with a Pokeball. See if we can catch him. His Magnemite's not so great, and Magneton's not so great, but the, um... If you evolve him further than that, and you get to, um... Oh, what's his name? Mag... Oh, wow, super... Micro Magnemite. That is awesome. Damn it. Magnemite. I am so sorry I caught the last one. Go over Pidgeotto. You getting you get nice fanged. You gonna give me feathers? No feathers? That's cruel. Uh, so I was also digging out some land, doing a little bit of landscaping underground. I'm thinking of uh, adding a, a, a basement uh, that we can store stuff in. We got some of these blaze powders. Uh, I guess we can't get blaze rods or anything. That that would be that would be too useful. Uh, but the blaze powder is neat. If uh, if we can play our cards right, and get some Ender Pearls as well. Just need to, you know, kill a bunch of Alakazams, I guess. But if we can play our cards right and get some of those, then we will have the ability to find the end. And assuming that no one has claimed the uh, end portal and made it impossible to get there, then that means we could travel to the end and fly around on a, a flying Pokemon and fight the end, end Dragon if we want to. And that would be pretty awesome to just build a... Uh, to have an outpost there. Hold on, I forgot to do T Deposit 200. Need to do that, because otherwise we're going to run out of funds pretty soon. Let's, let's just run out here and see where we end up. Uh, I'm hoping to find a way into an Extreme Hills biome. Sorry, I got the sniffles. So that I can acquire more Pokemons. Also, uh, just a reminder, I am really sick today, and that's why I'm sniffling and coughing and all of that stuff. So please don't make fun of me. Feel bad for me. Feel very bad for me. My throat hurts. My nose is stuffy. And everything is evil and everything is horrible. And I couldn't concentrate on my master's thesis, so I went and played video games. Uh, and now I'm just getting ahead on videos. I'm probably, um, 
Also, if, if this video is coming out like several weeks after I started, well, it's not. It's going to come out like in a few days. Um, I'm, I haven't been sick that long. This is all just recorded over a two-day period of time where I've been sick and I've been at home and I've just decided, okay, I need to do some recording. I need to get some recording out of the way so that I can work on my thesis. And yeah, that's, that's the thing. Like when I'm sick and I can't concentrate on other stuff, playing video games helps. Makes you feel a lot better. This snow biome, man. This snow biome. That mine shaft. Let's uh, let's run over here. I think I saw a Pokemon down here somewhere. No. Just my imagination. Just the acid. I like that you can do that. You can click on the apricorns and they drop, even though we're we're in a world where switches are, well, switching is on, but where you can't destroy stuff. That's neat though. It's a it's a place you can always get apricorns if you just sail out from spawn. You can always get get to an area and just pick up some apricorns. Start your own little farm out here, or start your own little farm back at your home. I mean. So many pink ones. So many pink ones. Really don't need the pink ones because I don't use love balls. I don't use love balls ever. In everness, ever. Found another snow biome. Maybe we're running in circles. I don't know. Uh, these rocks, I don't really know what they're for, but you can break them. I guess maybe they have, like, loot if you have Rock Smash or something. I don't know. I really do not know. I kind of wish we could obtain Surf, though. Surf and Fly. Uh, I know they don't actually do anything in outside of battle in this game, but Surf and Fly are good moves. Ooh. Cragnal. Uh, I'm not going to catch it. Not bothered. I just think he's cool looking. Incidentally, I've never finished Pokemon Black and White 2. I have the I have Pokemon Black and White 2 for my Game Boy or not my Game Boy for my uh, DS, uh, but I never finished it. It, it. it just was not. I don't know. There was something something about it that it didn't feel like feel right to me. So I just never never really liked it all that much. I liked it in the beginning. And then it just sort of dragged on for a while. Oh, wow. No! 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 Oh, okay. We're exploring. I guess we're trapped down here, so I guess we need to go to home. Uh, let's try a different direction. Let's go this way. Because I did have to cross like a huge snow biome to get out to this desert. Yeah, Slowpoke. Or Slowbro, I mean. Because we're kind of out in the middle of nowhere. Not gonna lie, it's kind of out in the middle of nowhere. Continue hopping. And there's a snow biome over there. Okay, I'll just go I'll go back this way then. I think that was the way we were going, so there's no point in going that way. Adventure time Adventure time in Pixelmon. I really, really, really shouldn't... Uh, oh, wait, hold on. I am... I am... Desert and snow. Oops. 
There we go. Let's wait for him to call. Oh, there we go. I put him in a good, uh, good spot right in the middle here. Oh, he has a Dragonite. Makes me feel less impressive considering I have I have been barely playing this at all, and uh, my Pokemon are all like low level and don't have any. Uh, don't have any cool Dragonites to fly around in. Just hanging out in this freaking swamp. Uh, hold on, I need to unequip. And... Oh yeah, I forgot. Alright guys, welcome back. Sorry for uh, the short, uh, or the uh, cut there that was completely unexplained. Uh, basically, I ended up wandering around for a while and realized that I was on an island consisting mainly of snow and one desert biome. So I took off a little further and found what appears to be a much larger island, and I found a village that hasn't been completely vaporized, which is great. Uh, it also has a nice jungle biome over here, and hopefully we'll find ourselves a uh, hill biome. And I'm actually going to cut the video pretty soon. I just need to... Uh, I just want to do something, really. just want to send off the video with something fun before I uh, edit things out. So we'll, we'll go and we'll try to find ourselves a nice battle and get ourselves some level ups. Uh, let's see. How big is this jungle? Oh, over there. I think that's Extreme Hills. Either that or it's still Jungle Biome. I don't know. Let's turn that 3 off for a second. There's Jungle Biome all the way over there, though. Yeah, it's probably just part of the Jungle Biome. Let's see if we can convince anything to spawn in here. Let's see if we can... Do anything with these. Think. Oh, come on. No, you have to break these. Yeah, and we can't break stuff. Oh. Alright, more jungle biome. Let's see, uh, we've got we've got one thing that spawned in there. I mean Mew can spawn in jungle biome, so if you want to be uh, a little cheeky, you can you can hang out here long enough and get Mew. And if you're playing a, if you're not playing on a server where you can't cheat, you can burn down the entire jungle and then look to see where Mew spawns, because it's a little easier to see it if the the jungle isn't there. You a Pokemon? No, you're a trainer. Well, let's kill you. <laughs> been a while since we've randomly attacked strangers. And we're getting all of no level ups here. There we go, one. This has to be his last guy. There we go. All right, we got some level ups there. Got some spawn edge going on. Uh, I also caught an Eevee. I, I think I uh, recorded that. I was just out wandering and found a pack of Eevees and went and caught one. Whoa, 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 whoa. We don't want to do that. No! 
Oh, now we're trapped down here. There's no way to dig or build here, so we have to teleport out. Let's wander around a little bit, see if there's a... No, not that way. The way up over here? Looks like it. No. Alright, then we have to do home. And this will bring us all the way back out here. That was right at the, the front of the desert biome, I think. And apparently we are ca we are having the uh, strobe light effect again, because I was surfing. Really don't know what to do about that, because you have to close out of the entire game. You can't just disconnect and reconnect. You have to close the entire game client and open it again. And that means I have to start the recording all over again. Wait, did we teleport, like... Don't tell me this spawned me on a different island than the one I was at previously. Because I have been to like six different islands, but I'm pretty sure I saved when I got... Oh, well, I'm going to cut the video here, because nothing exciting is going to happen. It's just me wandering around aimlessly until I find an Extreme Hills biome. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.